It's a nature park. Oh, huh. October 25th, Gord Lake Park entrance. This is where it happened. Yeah. Gord Lake is in the middle of this park. I can see more police walking around in here. Questioning people, probably. Oh, no. Oh, Gordy's. <sighs> hey, isn't that Detective Gumshoe over there? Yeah. Well, pal! Now, there's enough of us here. Found any? Found out anything yet? So, 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 sorry, sir. Noth nothing. <laughs> Idiots! The trial's tomorrow! Oh, we need really clues me. on the double! Uh, but, but, sir, there aren't any clues. That's why we arrested the attorney, Mr. Edgeworth. It's clear, sir. He's the one who... Shut up! Just you twice saying that again. I'll, uh... I'll make you sorry if you do. That's right, because they're partners. I mean, just, whatever. just get out of my face, pal. Y y yes, sir. Detective Gumshoe's kind of scary today. Ooh. Recruits. Peh. Peh. Ah! <laughs> hey, you're the hairy guy. Hairy butts. <laughs> he always calls us hairy butts. Right. Phoenix Wright. Will he ever learn my name? Stefan. Jack Stefan. What is that from? Simpsons. Oh. No, it's a commercial in the 90s. Huh? Uh, well, yes, I suppose. I well, I'm here to help. Ask me anything you want. Bring it. <laughs> Bring it. He seems different than usual. I wonder what's up. Everything. Um, Mr. Edgeworth hasn't actually asked us uh, to defend him yet. Huh? Oh, you you don't say. Oh, so I gotta talk to him, I guess. Detective Gumshoe, do you know what happened here? Huh? You don't know, pal? No. Wow, okay. Mr. Head in the Fluffy Pink Clouds Lawyer. In the Fluffy Pink Prince. Head in the... Huh? Never mind, I'll tell you. It happened last night about 15 minutes after midnight. 15 minutes after midnight. There was a boat out on Gold Lake. And the boat with two men. One of those men shot the other with a pistol. Yeah, hey, a logical <laughs> weapon. It's been always like yeah. the thinker statue the thinker, or thinker, a yeah. giant spear. This isn't just a freaking gun. Mm -hmm. That works. And the shooter was Mr. Edgeworth. Wait, that was actually my line. Oh, I, okay. Few minutes, okay. A cop who arrived on the scene arrested him. Should, should we start? Huh? No. Start what? The pizza. Yeah, go ahead. It's already cut. It's cold. Just grab a piece, yeah. How did he get in there so fast? Wait, how did he get there so fast? Well, there was a witness. When the report came in, we wasted, like, a witness. Oh, no. I just remembered it. You don't think Mr. Edgeworth is a murderer? Absolutely not! It's impossible! But we saw the cutscene ourselves. <laughs> I don't care if there's a witness, either. I don't believe a wick of it. Right. Who cares uh, what the witness says? I care! You really believe in him, don't you, detective? Of course I do! But... The police are pretty sure he's a killer. Nobody's even really taking his investigation that seriously. Oh no. After all the help Mr. Edgeworth had been to us, Hard to imagine, no one's standing up to, standing up to take his side. Well, at least you are, Detective. At least you are. Alright. Do you know, uh, who will be Mr. Edgeworth's defense attorney in, in tomorrow's trial? No, he'll just defend himself. <laughs> right. He hasn't got one yet. What? The trial is tomorrow, isn't it? Well, I don't know the whole story, but apparently no one, 
the one he's been taking will be willing to take his case. Oh, why not? Mr. Edgeworth won't tell me. When you guys showed up, I figured he would ask you to defend him. Uh, unfortunately not. Well, pal, you got a job to do. Help out Mr. Edgeworth. Prove that badge you wear into some fancy piece of metal. Prove it to me, pal. Show me you're an attorney. Right, sorry about that. Who was this witness? Uh, sorry, pal. That's confidential. Anyway, the witness saw everything, apparently. I'm sure they'll turn up in the trial tomorrow. Was there only one witness? Yep. It was pretty cold out in the lake last night. And it was Christmas Eve, after all. Still, we be we're being thorough. You never know what you're, up what you're going to turn up another witness. That's why we're here today, checking things out. So far, we're coming up empty. Oh, it's Christmas Day. I've forgotten. What are you getting me for Christmas, Nick? Um, a bug? <laughs> Talk to Santa. <laughs> Talk to Santa. Hmm. Actually, you know what I thought of? Hmm. We have to show him our badge. The badge is the solution to everything. Your attorney's badge. Edgeworth. Let me defend you. Mm. Ha! Ha ha! Good one, right? But I'm not that hard up. Not yet. Well, what do you mean by that? Me? Trust a wet behind the airs liar with only three trials under his belt? Never. What? what My case is near hopeless, right? Every defense attorney I've taken has turned me down. What? Simply put, they were afraid they'd lose. It occurred to me that I might be it, it might be my fault that they lost confidence. After all, I did get every single one of their clients declared guilty. <laughs> Maybe he's doing this as a suicide pact. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Regardless, I don't want you involved in this. You in particular, I cannot ask to do this. Alright, have fun in jail. <laughs> Prison. But, whatever. Edgeworth, this is really hard for me to ask. But, you didn't do it, right? Right? Think what you will. I have only one request. Huh? Stay out of this case. Why? But... Nick is trying to help you. I know. I know that. But I don't want your help, okay? <gasps> Why not? Uh, look, just go away and leave me alone. <laughs> I don't want to talk to anybody. Nick. Go in my room. Mr. Edgeworth did, didn't he? Maya! Let's go and investigate elsewhere. But, Nick. But nothing. Let's go, Gordon Lake. I think he yeah. wants to commit suicide because he lost the location. <laughs> Let me show him the badge. That's his unnecessary feeling. That badge! You're showing that to the wrong guy, pal. You gotta show it to somebody who needs it. Okay. Anything else we can talk about? Oh, defense request. It, is it true? No one will take Mr. Edwards' case? Yeah. He's a bit of a celebrity. If you've defended him and lost, your reputation is soon as suffer. What's more, the case against him is, well, it's pretty solid. Suppose it would be if they had a witness. Hey, pal! Don't tell me you're going to turn your back on him, too! Remember the Steel Samurai! 
Mr. Edgeworth helped you get your client the client innocent. I know. I went to Edgeworth. I tried. He really wants a representative. Especially not us, he said. What? Well, that doesn't make any sense, pal. You should have heard him talk about you after the Seal Samurai case. He kept saying, white, 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 over and over. <laughs> That's white, creepy. White, blue, and white. That's really creepy. It's him, it's him in his room. Right. 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 Like he's going, like, like this right is just written on the walls everywhere, just drinking. Right. Right. It's like, uh, uh, Jumpshi goes in, like, you, you okay, sir? Right. Right. Hey. Right, I'm gonna get, come on. It what reminds you, me that. What are you writing on the wall? Right. On the wall, what were you writing? Right. It reminds me of the Simpsons episode where uh, the whole mystery of <laughs> no, Fish Hop, Mr. Burns. No TV. I am no, Homer Simpson. No TV Whoa. and no beer makes Whoa. Homer That's something, something else. Something. That's something else completely. No matter what I do that. No What's TV up? and no beer get makes Mo. Homer Simpson something. Mo. But there was an episode uh, where uh, Mr. Burns woke up um, from that um, from being shot, and he get. And the only things that he just said was Homer Simpson. Homer Simpson, yeah. Nick? I'm not sure that's a good sign. Neither am I. Why Why wouldn't he want your help? I don't get it. Detective Gupchusher! What? Find something? Um, no sir, not yet. Okay. But there was a call from the precinct. They want to hold an investigation briefing. A briefing? Why? I'm off. Oh. Sorry, pal. I guess you heard. I gotta go. Any last thing you need to ask me about before I head back? Autopsy report. Mm -hmm. Sounds like important. Well, yes. Do you have any information on the victim? Sorry. They haven't worked up an autopsy report yet. I'm still waiting for it myself. Actually, say, if you get the time to walk by the precinct, we can talk more there, pal. Detective Gumshoe gave you his directions to the police station. Oh, hey, Detective Gumshoe. Well, what? Um, we gotta take a look around the park. Can we walk around? Yeah, no problem, pal. You get my permission. Yeah, for the first time. Yeah, look at that. You know, Nick, I think there's something to be said about talking to people when they're busy. Yeah, they don't have time to think about not giving you information. Right. <laughs> so, uh, right. Now let's go and uh, get... Now let's get investigating. Yep. Let's go. Move. I still think Edgeworth did it. Oh, we can go. Act. Let's go to Gord Lake. Do you want